Happy July 1st! First of July, new month, so we're going to be showing you everything that's new at the Springs, especially Gideon's. Yes, and July 1st through August 11th is, what is that called? Uh, flavors of Florida. We're looking at it right there. Yes, so anything that has a Flavors of Florida orange sign has a specialty of orange or citrus flavor for Florida. So, so if you like orange, now's your chance. Come yep. to the springs. But we are heading first to Gideon's to get the cookie of the month. It is a repeat. We will show you. So hopefully you enjoy it. Yeah, but and then we'll show you what's new at Deluxe Burger. Uh, we'll see what other little restaurants have anything new and we'll show you. Yep. So come along with us and this will be fun. We always like day ones of the new month at Disney Springs. So awesome. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and look at this wonderful balloon. We still need to do the balloon. Let us know if you've done that, how it is. We're, I mean, we're excited to go on that. Look at the fountain. And it's a light crowd today, so not a ton of people here yet. It's only 11.45. All right, we can show you our, the first new item we found, Chef Art Smith's Homecoming. They have a dragon fruit mojito and a Cuban sandwich. You know, if we don't find anything else uh, new for lunch, this may be a lunch option. But then the drink looks fab. Okay, this is a site we have never seen before. There's basically no line at Gideon's. I don't know if that's because the springs have recently opened. No, nope. oh, it's a Monday afternoon. So. No line. All right, here's this month's little menu. That kind of looks like, what do you think that looks like, a monkey? Uh, I was thinking a turtle. Uh, oh, skunk ape. All right, I was close. Anyway, a lot of new things here. We got two cookies. We got key lime pie cake bars. That's interesting. So instead of a slice of cake, so we'll have to try a couple things. All right, new this month, they have a key lime pie cake bar. Look at that. We may have to try one of those dipped in chocolate. That looks fantastic. And we have the peanut butter and chocolate cake. We may have to try that sometime. Oh, these cake slices are really good. Looks like the hanger bar has something new for July for flavors of Florida. Let's see what it is. I bet it's orange and citrusy. Uh, orange Pilsner goat cheese dip. Okay, I would try that. I would try that. Uh, frozen tangerine, frozen margarita. Orange tangerine, oh, that looks good. Sunshine stroll, orange Pilsner. It's the same on both sides. Same on both sides. But yeah, this place is great. You could always just walk around to this side and seat yourself. So. Yeah, maybe we'll come back for the chips if we have time. STK, this is back. I wanted to get this last time. $19.99 filet for lunch. And you know their filets are normally like $55, so maybe we'll be back this week. Look at this, all the goods have been acquired. We have the orange pecan chocolate chip cookie, lemon poppy crumb cookie, and then we have the key lime cake bar. So that's kind of a new item to get a cake bar. And we have had the orange citrus cold brew before, so we thought we'd go with our favorite, which is the peanut butter cold brew. So let's dig in. All right, Andrea had a great idea. Last time we tried to break this one, we had chocolate all over our hands. So she's gonna cut it in half. But yes, this is the orange blossom chocolate chip. Ooh. That looks lovely. It actually doesn't look bad. It does look really good. I think I'll go in. Let's get a little corner. Oh, I see a big it's slice a of orange piece right of there. Orange in there. I really like this one. I'm not sure Andrea will be crazy about the orange, but also has a pecan too. Yeah, it's two yeah, of my favorite things. <laughs> really good. I'm gonna have to have another bite. All right, Andrea. It's not terrible. 
I just don't like orange. But the pecan's candied, so that's pretty good. Oh yeah, candy pecan. I think I can handle it. All right. Well, we have this to snack on all week long. I'm gonna have another little bite. Yeah, definitely a candy pecan. I would rate this one pretty high, actually. We were worried about all the orange ones that we weren't wild about last year, but this one I think is improved. I think it does taste better than when we had it last year. Yeah, I would give this a solid eight. You know, not my favorite cookie, but real good. Definitely will finish it. She's coming home with us. All right, lemon poppy seed. I remember liking this one last year and it was a little strong lemon flavor for Andrea. Oh, looks like something new is in there. Let me get you a little corner here. There you go. All right, here we go with the lemon. I already want to try it at the same time. Yeah, we'll go at the same we'll time. We'll try it at the same time. Cool. So when you get chocolated out, there's no chocolate there. You would really like this one. It's very lemony. Very lemony. So my first thought is when I took a bite, I liked it because it's really cakey and soft, but then the lemon hits really hard and I am not a lemon person. Mm. So I do say I will have to go with, believe it or not, the orange chocolate one this oh, time. Oh, it's the winner? Yeah. I do prefer this one this year as well. I would still give this one, you know, like at least a seven. Um, not, let me see what this is here. It's a different color. Oh, okay, those are white chocolate chips. Oh. So maybe you needed a bite that was heavy with that. Here's one by itself. I'll take that alone. Yeah, it's a white chocolate chip. That might be new from last year, having the chips in there. Okay, I like that. <laughs> she likes <laughs> the white chocolate chip. All right, give a little chaser with our peanut butter cold brew. Which we already know is awesome. Oh, fantastic. Our favorite cold brew, I mean, hands down. So this is definitely new. So the cake bar, key lime pie cake bar, right? Bites. Yeah, I think I got that. All right, let's know. just cut it right in half. Okay, it's, oh, it's got a hard uh, chocolate looks, layer. And it's cold, so maybe it's frozen. Oh, goodness. Okay, there we go. So it is, uh, it does talk about the crisp and then key lime cake dipped in chocolate, like a crumb coating. Yeah. Uh, I'm not sure it could. Almost looks granola. Okay, there we go. I got it. I'm gonna try this as is. So I got a little bit of everything. That's like a lot of filling it looks like in there. So it tastes like a key lime pie, which I know is also not your favorite, <laughs> but it's chocolatey and it's not super strong lime. Here, try that. So you may like it more than a key lime, traditional key lime pie. Does it smell like it? Oh yeah, it smells like key lime. So I do like it better than the lemon because the lemon cookie is extreme lemon flavor. This is a more subtle key lime flavor, yeah. but still it's dark chocolate. Not my favorite chocolate, but I, it's worth trying, I think, just because it's something new and it's kind of got like three different layers of. Yeah, and I agree that it's not strong lime like a normal key lime pie. So that's the only difference. It's a little more subtle lime. But there we have it. We've tried everything, all three new items for July. Um, and I think it might even be through August 11th, but at least the orange related items. But yeah, this one I think is the winner and it's much improved from last year, I think. I, I would rate this really high up on all of our favorite cookies. Yep. All right, hope you guys could come out and check out the Gideons. Oh, this peanut butter man.
All right, here's the offerings for a deluxe burger. We have a citrus burger, signature blend patty, braised pork belly, grapefruit, aioli, yep, pickled fried fennel. I would have to pass on that because of the grapefruit, but it might be your cup of tea. Key lime gelato shake, that looks pretty good. Sunshine Stroll Orange Pilsner Draft. All right, so we'll probably pass on Deluxe Burger this month, but there you go. Um. All right, now we're showing you Amaretts right across from World of Disney. They do have a pretty good looking one. Orange, hazelnut, petite. I'm gonna butcher this one. Gato, <laughs> Gato, I don't know. Orange mousse, orange curd, honey, orange gel. $8, that's not bad. Orange slushy with vodka. And again, and again, we mentioned that they do have sandwiches now, which we have yet to try. So already, there's already several options for lunch that that's right. would be new to us. So if we can't find Andrea something at Chef Arts, maybe we'll come back and we'll show you their sandwiches. Yeah. All right, let's see what the new merch at World of Disney is. All right, we're at World of Disney. They still have play in the park. That's not new. We do believe this is new. So, Citronella candle. Yeah, for $40, $39.99. Holy moly, $40, all right. Not sure if that's new or not. It is, it's a thicker long sleeve. All right, well, that's pretty also cool. Anything on the back? No, just on the nope. front. Oh, and that's what it would look like if it were on you. Oh, there is some new ears, though. Looks like Mick Mini at the beach. Oh, they're right over here. Oh, and they have sliders that go with it. And hats. <laughs> so, very cool. Okay, so we're not seeing a lot new here. We're thinking it's all going to be next door at the co-op, where it's going to be the Flavors of Florida and all the orange-themed merch. Yeah, we were well, here a couple of days ago, and not that we can remember everything, but haven't seen too many different items. Right, so... Let's go check the co-op. That's probably all the new orange yeah. stuff. We can maybe get out right here. All right, next door to World of Disney Marketplace Co-op. And they do have flavors of Florida, mugs, cups. There we go. Here's a full display okay so the shirt still does not look new yeah the shirts are not new oh that's new i don't know so maybe only this right here is new i guess this is a lot no it's like a pillow no it's like one of those oh munchkins yeah munchlings munchlings <laughs> <laughs> munchling so not seeing a lot of new things here it just looks like a little display over here so we're at polite pig they do have a new drink for july but she did not have the banana liqueur so she couldn't do it she did give me a little sample of their kiwi uh i forget what it's called but it's kiwi drink and it's the drink for june and i just tried it and it is fantastic yeah it's like kiwi lemon different things so I would recommend this drink, but it'll probably change out. Yeah, because it, it's just leftover from last month, and they're just using it until they get their new uh, supplies in. So. Right. But I like it, and it's a decent sample, so cheers. All right, look at all this, guys. Holy cow. Here's the new orange bird dome cake. Whew. And then as we see from the menu they do have new signature sandwiches so we're gonna give them our whirl here's the one on the sign outside and all the new sandwiches okay, okay. so we did get the turkey and brie from Amaretz 
and it's turkey brie bacon looks very good and we just cut this in half but it looks like a really good sandwich comes with chips and andrew got the specialty drink the bayou lemonade and got a little flower lavender did you try that yet definitely can taste the lemonade and the lavender and it's very subtle and refreshing awesome i'll try a quick little bite of the sandwich a turkey brie all right the turkey is really good quality shaved turkey very nice um slight sweet flavor i guess from the brie and the uh probably the honey bacon but yeah it's a good sandwich chips look good I haven't tried them so we now have another lunch option <laughs> it's good so it is a good tasting sandwich I think it is the um, mustard and that sweet like honey sauce and the applewood bacon but I think it's very good and splitting it is perfect size and we each get a little bit of the chips. So I think I would come here again. They got two other sandwiches that we could get, the uh, roasted vegetable and then a roast beef. We found a hidden Mickey, look at that. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so Disney Springs and it's right outside Disney style. So if you see it, take a picture and let us know. <laughs> yeah, that's like the first one I've just spotted randomly at Disney Springs, I think. And we walked down here so many times. A lot. <laughs> All right, that's it for Disney Springs. We're actually gonna hop over to Epcot and we'll try to show you what's new there. Maybe we'll find some new, new food, new snacks. So it'll be a little two-part video. So let's hop on over. And like that, we're at Epcot, and it is time to continue our day. So let's see if we can find some new food. I kind of think we're just uh, here for food, and then if we get a ride, that is just an added bonus. Oh yeah, yeah. We but did check uh, Guardians, the virtual queues, full for today. So. Yeah. But, but now it is 4:30. So. Honestly, we also just like to come out, take in the sights, so. Yeah, we don't we have write something, ride. like I said, that's just a bonus for us. Oh, 10 minutes for Spaceship Earth. Yeah, I ten did. Minute. That's usually a walk on. Yeah, I did check. Um, most of the rides are actually really good. I think the highest was 60. Or out, the high, yeah, highest was 60, and that is Ratatouille. It's kind of a light crowd here on July 1. Not too bad, so, but we're gonna check into Disney Traders, see if they have any new merch, new for July. Let's see, maybe some, something orange related. We're trying to decide if this is new or not. Walt the Dreamer statue. Ooh, $95, so better to have a discount. Epcot Ratatouille shirt. Oh, it's just Epcot in general. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so it's got... Oh, yeah, it's got Olaf, it's Olaf, got Remy, Dory, Adore. Figment. Huh. Nice. I like the ears. Those are nice. Epcot. So that actually matches the shirt. It's got the same little figures on it, pretty much. Oh, and a regular Epcot tee, t-shirt. That's nice. It looks thin. Okay, so I do. Oh, look at the hat. All right, the hat's oh, cool. That's pretty cool. All right, I like the hat. Huh, cool. $29.99. Is that what it is? Yeah, right here. Oh, right there. $29. That's not oh, bad at all. Look at that. The, yeah, I saw the, the bill underside. Cool. All right, that's nice. Oh, here's Oh, the so that's jacket. That's what the back of it looks like. And then the front. Oh, nice. And it's a light little jacket. I like it. It feels soft. How much is that? Uh, oh, 
55. That's cool. I like it. All right, that was Disney Traders. Here's Port of Entry. We'll see what all they have. Huh. It's a small world. I think we've seen that. Yeah, I usually don't like the store as much as the other one we just came from. It's a cool bag, though. I think we saw this at World of Disney. Oh, yeah. That's an interesting shirt. I actually kind of like it. I like the hats. Cool. Oh, Mickey on the back. That is also $29.99. This got some hats and ears. Oh, that's another style of the Mickey hat, kind of like what I'm wearing. That's nice. And here is the hat I'm wearing. <laughs> Okay, the stores and resorts all have the fourth years. So I think that's about it for this store. Not a lot of new stuff. You may have to get some fourth years. You may. They, well, they feel comfy. Look. Yeah. They seem soft. I can tell looking at them, they kind of look comfy. There's monorail silver. All right, so we did score a Magic Band Plus at Character Warehouse for only twenty dollars. See what it does. Wave like nobody's watching. It worked. It's playing. Is that all it does a song. Let's see what this one does. <laughs> Clearly, we're new to the Magic Band Plus. All right, once again, just wave your arms around like nobody's watching. Da -da -da. Is the dog doing? Oh! Ah. Well, there we go. Very nice. We got a bark and a guitar play. <laughs> oh, if you guys could only smell inside the air coming out. It smells like water, it smells like tortillas, it smells like just awesome, right? Yeah, we got the best smells coming out of here. And folks are literally just hanging out in here because it's the coolest spot. It's ice cold, awesome. All right, let's see. Oh yeah, the oh, this, falling it looks out lovely the door in Oh yeah, La Cava has a huge line. Look at those. So they do have some great margaritas here, but it's very popular. And everyone wants to go. Okay, we did here in Werther's Original. There's a new cookie. Here we found it. Oh, it smells awesome in here. Oh, that's cool. It's Mickey shaped. Yeah, and it's got caramel inside. We may have to take this with us. Yeah, but maybe let's see if we can get food, food first. Food first. We may have to come back for that. It smells amazing. They make the homemade popcorn here in there's popcorn. But unfortunately, where there's popcorn, you have to eat it here because it does not last to take. Yeah, it does get stale. All right, so we have never been to Via Napoli. This will be another sit down for us. And they did have a walk up reservation for two right yeah. so who's excited so it's about 15 minutes not bad but they do have the window open outside here which we've never had either but when you have a walk up here at a brand new place to you you may as well you might as well yeah so this will be another one off our list via napoli they have good pizza uh but yeah the walk up window is open right there too so we've never tried that all right, everybody, we are via Napoli. This is a funny photo. I only see your head and then a giant pizza. <laughs> a giant pizza and a head. But we got the half meat lover and then the half capricola, capricola, something like that. It's like half veggie, half, um, half meat lover, but look at that. 
All right, I hope we're hungry. It does look good. The undercarriage looks nice and crisp. So, I mean, the only thing is, it, it was about a, how long ago wait? About 30 minutes. 30 minute wait, so it did take a little time. Yeah. Uh, but yeah, we will dig into this and we'll let you know. It looks fabulous. All right, so overall, a very good pizza. It's got a really good undercarriage, like nice and crispy. We did hear you have to order them well, but this is plenty and very, very good. Uh, good sauce, good cheese. So, so far so good. Do you like it as well? This one's a little bit more floppier, but maybe it has to do with the artichokes. Probably. Oh, that's a little watery. Yeah. But good flavor. Uh -huh. Yeah, I'm looking forward to trying the veggie side too. Yeah, we got half meat, half veggie. Oh, look at those brick ovens. Those are awesome. Uh, oh, lovely, lovely, lovely. I do like those ovens. All right, we came, we conquered. And we're stuffed. We are stuffed. It's good food. Highly recommend the pizza here. Not sure if we saw these last time. I really like the Epcot shirt. And look at this app culture. Yeah, I like this one. They're both twenty nine ninety nine. Yeah, that's cool. It's not that thick material. I like it though. And then you got long sleeves over there. Yeah, I do believe this is all all new. The bottles, long sleeve app culture. Very cool. So the long sleeves is thirty nine ninety nine. And. This is what you might look like. <laughs> cool. Yeah, I like the new... I would have the t-shirt. This one right here, actually. Okay, we saw those earlier. And we saw the Epcot shirts. A lot of stitch stuff still. Mickey and Minnie Crocs. I don't remember seeing this either. Well, I don't remember this one. Yeah, you're right. Oh my gosh, my, my sister would love that. I think she would like it. It's got the front. Cool. And then a mini backpack. Yeah. Not to be confused with a mini backpack, a small one. All right, we may have stumbled onto Loungefly Central. There are a bunch. Look at that one. And there's even a Carl one over there I'll show you. All right, solid colors. We've seen the Mickey one. Uh, not sure if we've seen this one. Even has uh, Darth Vader mixed in. Ahsoka. Plain King. But look at this. Carl. A Carl bag. Alright, that's funny. I like that. Mm. What's the dog's name again? He's on the side. Doug. Doug. Alright, Doug. Yeah, Doug is on the side. And then you got Russell. Oh, Russell's on that side. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, first time at Via Napoli. So another sit down offer list. Pizza, very good, highly recommend. Yes, just come hungry for sure. Yeah, we didn't get to show the new food over by uh, the new area, 
Yeah, the Kamakura uh, area Kamakura. has a uh, festival favorites. And it looks like they had three different items. It was like two little dessert things. And a bunch of craft beers. So. Yeah. But they do have little snackies over there. We'll have to show you that another time. Yep. But hope you enjoyed the day. We started at Disney Springs, showed you the new merch there. Here, we showed you a bunch of new Epcot merch, which is very really cool. So. Yep. so thanks for coming along with us for our whole day. And yep. give, us a, give us a thumbs up. Thumbs up. <laughs> Subscribe. And come along tomorrow. We're hoping to score a Tiana. Yes. Uh, first time and maybe even a rock and roller coaster um, since it just opened today. Yep. So, so all see right, you see on you our next adventure. See you next time. Bye.